In this video, we'll be solving a question related to the normal distribution. The problem statement given is that the marks of 100 students in an examination follow a normal distribution with mean 70 and standard deviation 5. So we have to find the number of students whose marks will be less than 65, more than 65 and between 65 and 75. So first let's start with the given data, We're writing the given data. Here mean is 70 and standard deviation is 5. We all know that for all x, the standard normal variate z is equal to x minus mu by sigma. That is x minus 70 by 5 is equal to z. Okay. So, the next step would be less than 65. So, p of x less than 65. So, at x is equal to 65, z value changes to be 65 minus 70 by 5 so z value becomes minus 1 so p of x less than 65 is similar to p of x less than minus 1 uh, or p of x z greater than 1 okay so write z here, here also z. So this is because of symmetricity. So p of z greater than 1 defines that, uh, let's take a number line from minus infinity to infinity and here is the 0. z greater than 1 means <clears throat> from 1 to this entire thing. So for that what we'll do, first we'll take from p of 0 to infinity minus phi of 0 to infinity minus phi of 1 to infinity 1 to infinity 0 to infinity is 0 0.5 minus phi of 1 phi of 1 value from the standard normal or table you can get the value that is 0 0.3413 and if you subtract, the answer would be 0 0.1587. So number of students scoring less than 65 would be out of, out of 1000 students given, right? So 1000 into 0 0.1587, that is 158.7 or 159 students. Uh, they have given to find more than 75. So p of x greater than 75 can at x is equal to 75, 75 minus 70 by 5 is equal to 1 is equal to z. So p of x greater than 75 can be written as p of z greater than 1 or p of x greater than 0 minus p of 0 to 1. Here it is 0 0.5 minus 5 of 1. So the answer is 0 0.1587 only. So for a thousand students, it will be thousand into 0 0.1587. That is 159 students. Now the third part says between 65 to 75. So we have to take P of 65 X 75. We have solved at x is equal to 65 and at x is equal to 75 and we know the values are minus 1 and 1 or this could be written as 2 times of 5 of 1 2 times of 0 0.341 0 0.6826 so this is the answer now multiplying it with uh, 1000 you get it as 1, 2, 3. Multiplying it with 1000, you get it as 0. Points. Multiplying it with 1000, 6826, you get it as 682. Students have scored between 65 to 75. So I hope you have understood how to solve this uh, question related to normal distribution. If you have any doubts, do let me know in the comments and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.